don't know if this Prime Minister learned basic reasoning, so let me explain. If you Madam Speaker, I encourage all members in this House to get with the program. That's the Community Volunteer Income Tax Program, a collaboration between local community organizations and the Canada Revenue Agency to deliver free tax clinics for Canadians. This collaboration between the CRA and dedicated volunteers across Canada allows us to give back to communities by helping residents to file their taxes. Local organizations across the country run these tax clinics for lower-income Canadians to help make sure that they are getting their benefits, like the Canada Child Benefit, the Canada Workers Benefit, Canada Carbon Rebate, and many more cost-of-living measures that they may be eligible for. I am so proud of the positive impact that we have made through the CVITP and look forward to repeating this success again in what will be a productive tax filing season this year. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Well, the Honourable Member for Portage Lister. After eight years of this Prime Minister, it's never been more expensive to feed your family, own a home, and heat your house. The price of everything is up, and the average family of four will spend an additional $700 this year on groceries compared to last. And now the Prime Minister is hiking the carbon tax by 23% on April 1st. But he's not done there. He's also jacking up the tax on beer, wine and spirits by 5% for good measure. Now I don't know if this Prime Minister learned basic reasoning, so let me explain. If you tax the farmer that grows the food, the trucker who ships the food, you tax all who buy the food. So what's the result? Two million Canadians now rely on a food bank, and 50% are $200 away from insolvency. Yet the Liberals think rebranding the carbon tax will stop the financial pain. Newsflash, it won't. Canadians live in reality. They know the carbon tax is a tax plan, not an environment plan. Only common sense Conservatives will axe the tax on everything, for everyone, and for good. Here, here. Well done. Honourable Member for Kelowna.